Okay, a few words about maybe the weirdest entry in the CRC Eurovision Song Contest, Finland. Uh, their song is called Aina Munpita, and they're, it's performed by Partikurika Nimipäivät, I think. Maybe I'm mispronouncing it. I work for a Finnish company, but my Finnish skills uh, still, after two and a half years, very, very limited, uh, unfortunately. Um, I have been traveling so much and been so busy so far this month, we're now in April, uh, and also in March, that I have not been digging into the details of this year's entries. But the versions of the song that I've seen are 90 seconds long, and that is half of what is allowed. And in the past, uh, when songs have been submitted that have been this short, they've been forced to um, lengthen them to the requisite three minutes or they would have been disqualified. I don't know if there is a longer version. Uh, there should be because all songs have to be three minutes, that's the rule, and I don't see why the rule should be working for Finland. But on the other hand, it would kind of be good if it only was 90 seconds because I really don't want another 90 seconds of this. Um, I understand that it has... Uh, theoretically, I agree with the message, like, they're singing about having more or less normal life with Down syndrome and that it's not fair that people with Downs are treated as children, even when they're adults. Uh, of course, everyone should be treated uh, in accordance with their personal abilities and not by the fact that they belong in some kind of grab bag of, um, of qualities. But ugh, nobody's going to understand that because the song isn't Finnish. Nobody understands Finnish um, and people are not going to be able to join the dots here, connect the dots. Um, the song is annoying and uh, it does not have a good melody in my opinion and it's very unvaried, it's very repetitive. Um, the genre, I, I, it's interesting to see the genre in the contest. I'm always happy to see new genres and new styles being introduced but I think this is not going to appeal to... it certainly will appeal to a number of people in Europe in most European countries, but those people, I believe, don't watch the Eurovision Song Contest. So, um, this is going to completely blow. Uh, it's not going to get any votes, it's going to sink without a trace in uh, the semis, and that's pretty much what it deserves. Finland, you are so weird. I mean, I love you guys, but you are the weirdos of Europe. Uh, I don't know what you're thinking. I really don't know what you're thinking to have sent this. Um, it's good to get some variety, but this song is really just repetitive and annoying and the singer can't sing and I'm sure that's a thing in punk. That's how it's supposed to be, but still, uh, for those of us not into that kind of music, yeah, it's just annoying. Um, Finland nil points, sorry. This does nothing for me except basically annoy me. Better luck next time, Finland. I, we know you can do it. Uh, and we're always excited to see what you're going to bring out because we always know it's going to be something completely, <laughs> completely out there. So, yeah. Uh, good luck to Finland. They're really going to need it, but it won't help. A bomb from Finland this year.